September is the World Alzheimer's Month. The CDC says more than 6 million Americans are living with the disease. And if you haven't cared for someone who has Alzheimer's, it can be hard to know the signs. Here's what you need to look out for. I think the biggest misconception when it comes to Alzheimer's disease is that a lot of the signs and symptoms of Alzheimer's are part of normal aging. As we get older, we may forget a few things here and there, but some signs of memory loss could mean something more serious, like the onset of Alzheimer's disease. This is where the context is important, the severity, the frequency, the magnitude of the memory loss, all significant. For example, Dr. Ashton says randomly forgetting someone's name or an appointment is normal forgetfulness, but being unable to recall the name of your child, parent, or spouse, consistently forgetting appointments and failing to keep track of time are concerning signs. She says the symptoms of Alzheimer's interferes with a person's daily living, whereas the normal aging process usually does not. When tasks like going to the store for a loaf of bread present a challenge, that could be a red flag. They never get there. They get lost. They forget why they went out. They come back without the loaf of bread. If you have any concerns, Dr. Ashton says to trust your gut and make an appointment for a formal medical evaluation. It should never be anyone's job to be their own doctor. If you are concerned about some of your signs or symptoms or those of someone that you care about, have a neurologist, a medical professional evaluate that person so that you don't have to ask yourself, is this normal or is it not normal? The Alzheimer's Association says more than 35 million people around the world have Alzheimer's. 30% of Americans have a family member with the disease.